vegan charcuterie tray. Open all your cabinets. Vegan gluten free. So crackers, gluten free pretzel crisp, wasabi flavored peas, some Mexican candy, some chocolate, gluten free wafers. We got some raw cashews here, some macadamia nuts, there's Brazil nuts, we got some organic tomatoes here, okra pickles, snackums, olives, grape leaves, whole garlic cloves. Stank. We got some mustard, some hummus, organic cute, organic mini sweet peppers. Mmm, this rosemary smells really good. I have a blood orange, a jalapeno, limon. No, this is this is going on the charcuterie tray. Organic red grapes, raspberries, mm, blueberries. This cheese is pretty good. I do prefer to keep it out at room temperature. This cheese is amazing. I really like it. And then this I'm going to be trying for the first time. They have several different varieties at Sprouts. Be on the lookout. This is the only gluten-free vegan one they have. The other ones have egg white protein and the pepperoni one has gluten in it. Here's the spread. Let's do it. I lost all track of time. It's time to go to the gym. Let's finish this tray. What do you say? Do these cucumbers look frozen? Oh, they're frozen. Let's got the aesthetic too. First attempt. Get real creative here. Ooh, that looks real cute. Oh, that's cute. Breathe, girl. All you gotta do is breathe. Yeah, girl, you better get it. So we're done with the meat. This will be the last thing of cheeses. Long skinny ones, short fat ones. We'll make it work. That looks really nice. Put these tomatoes back. These okra pickles are bomb. Here. Oh, cute. Oh, cute. Add some over here. Trying to be healthy here. Oh, this is cute. Move bowl. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that looks cute. That looks cute. That looks cute. Yeah, that's cute. And then we'll top it with all the dry stuff. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, lovers. Okay, doke. I gotta put these pickle okras on. Oh, two peas in a pod. I'm not vibing with the broke dick vibe. What? Look how pretty this is looking. Hmm, cute! I don't really see room for crackers. This looks really fucking cute, yo. <laughs> I'm just saying. It's cute. It's so cute. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. I love this. I love it. Oh, cute. This is really cute. Good job, Christina. <laughs> it's just cute. It's cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Yeah, it's cute. This is so much fun. Tony ate a blueberry last night and he was bouncing off the walls. Mm, these are not really cute. They're not doing it. So you always have that freedom. That's ugly. Move along. Well, I don't have any olives on the tray. I could put olives. I love olives. Okay, that looks cute. Well, it looks a little weird. Cute is weird sometimes, you guys. Oh, um, this will be cute. Oh, that's cute. Bam, three. So cute, it looks so nice right there. Oh my god, this is so much fun, you guys. Please make a charcuterie tray at your house or your job. I need scissors. Should I add an orchid? I could put it right there on that jalapeno. I 
anything for aesthetic, right? I love it so much. Oh, maybe like, oh, like just a little bow in front. So pretty. It's a party. A couple of really important things that I did learn about the actual church pottery tray is to place each item intentionally. A lot of it's about aesthetic with the tray, especially if you're gonna serve it for a party. I'm so happy right now.